because it's so dark outside. Is it 6.02 a.m.? If you can see that. And where are we heading? I don't know. Where are we going? We're going to the flea market. Are we getting fleas? We're going to go buy some fleas. I feel something behind us. There's a trailer behind us. And we want to empty our trailer today. So I can buy more units. And we can buy more stuff. So today is Saturday. <laughs> what is the date today? I have no idea. The 6th? The 5th? Today is March 5th. Who knows when you'll be seeing this, but remember... We set up with the flea market on Saturday, March 5th. It is the first nice weekend day of the year so far. They say it's going to hit 70 today. Yeah, it might only be 44 degrees now, but once the sun comes up, it shows that it's really going to warm up nicely. So we're taking advantage of this because you just never know. They're calling for rain tomorrow. And as I tell him, pick one day, one day out of the weekend. We do this maybe once a month, twice a month. Depends on what we're buying. So here we go. We were up at 4.30 a.m. to go make some money. Well, there's someone in the booth. $25. Jeezy. Hello. Hello. How are you today? You getting it unhooked? It's unhooked. All right. Well, guess what, guys? They went up to $25 a booth. It's still not bad. Well, we take four. A person that comes down and does one, so we have to sell volume today. The first hundred covers these spots. You can see the trailer here. So, you can see the length of the truck. We have all of this area to set up. Wait till you see once we get things set up. He's going to back the truck right in front of the trailer there. We've been so busy that I've not updated you or showed you anything of us unloading. It's been a lot of work. I still have all this to fill. This is my area, but everything of mine was buried, so I've got it now that I can get it out. But look at this. I haven't even counted the tables, and he's still digging. Let me go show you what's still on the trailer. There's our truck. Subscribe, YouTube, Adventures with the Hudsons. All right, this is the side door. This still items to go through. There's an old Marlboro um, duffel bag. I really should look that up. That could be worth some money. You know, they don't, I don't know that they give out so much cigarette stuff anymore. Oh, there's some gun safety locks up there. So this is, this was packed. This is what we're at now. Now it's time for the crowd to show up. Look here, he's recording. What is your YouTube channel? Vincent's Valuables. And you guys got to go check him out. Vincent's Valuables on YouTube. Yeah, subscribe, sharing, subscribe, get him up there. Hit the like button, share, and get him some more subscribers. How many uh, subscribers you got now? Uh, 19,000. Wow, you're cool. way ahead of you're us. Ahead. We're like 7,500. Let's go. Jim, remember this bag? It was from your unit. From the gun unit. From the gun unit. Well, these are all coach purses. I found money. We're at the flea market. I found money. The Victoria's Secret, Secret. coach. It probably came with uh, when they bought something. Yeah. Coach. 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 An MR coach. Yes, hold on. Because we have receipts for some of A them. coach. We don't for these, but Not they've for these, all got but... the tags inside. They have the leather tags. One, two, three, four, five coach purses, a bag of money, and some watches. For our watch life. 
I hit gold. Well, the wind got awful, so we couldn't video. You can see that we're getting packed up. We have a mess back here. I'm making a goodwill pile here, a trash pile. That everything has been blowing. I think we've been having 50 mile an hour winds, so we're trying to get it done. And there he is trying to put things in there. So we didn't get much video because of it, but we did do a dollar sale. So that trailer is not going to be very full. Well, I think I showed you this this morning. A lot of that up there is empty containers, all by that side door, empty containers. Half of the trailer, look, it's got all these tables, but we need them for the flea market. Oh, and there's Jim. He's got a couple more things to put in. Put your hands. Yes, your hands are very dirty. Oh, don't touch me. So, we're about ready to go. I think we did good with the dollar sale, so we'll have to let you know. It's a lot of work. It is 4.30, a little after. What time is it? 4.23. 4.23. We'll be hooked and out of here at 4.30, home by 5. We are coming through the town of Troy, Ohio. Where are we going? We're going on estate sales. Woohoo! Well, we've been down here before and had lunch. No, we had brunch in the downtown area of Troy. It's still a pretty day. 68 degrees. It's not going to last. They're teasing us here in Ohio. But look at all the old town fill of the restaurants. We ate at Basil's on the market right there. We had a Sunday brunch there with family. So now we are going to the estate sale. So hope you enjoy it and we'll show you when we get there. We made it. Show in the back of your coat, lift up that hood. You think people know who we are now? So this looked like an assisted living area, but it's not. So we'll ask permission to film in here. If not, we will show you what we find on the way out. Oh, those are pretty. Mm -hmm. Look, I just bought a bag full of jewelry. I have all this and all this to put in there. So guess what you're gonna see on an auction? Jewelry. You said everything? We're taking the scenic route from Troy, Ohio to Piqua, Ohio. And again, you all know, I tell you many a times, Piqua, Ohio is my hometown. How'd you do that at, at that estate sale? I think I did pretty good. I think we did very good. How much did we spend? Do you remember? $67. $67. So once we get home and we're unloading this truck, we will show you everything that we bought. Now you did see some of the jewelry. We have two bags of jewelry. And again, everything he bought and all my jewelry, we spent $67. It's nice to have 50% off day at the last day. That's what they offer. Not everyone offers it, so you really have to watch and ask. Aim because I wanted the cart because I had something to put in it. I got a jackpot. And all I had to put in it was the cookie jar that is false craft, and he's found all this Revere wear. Let me show you this. A little salt, lemon juice, or barkeeper's friend. A barkeeper's friend? Or, yeah, barkeeper's friend. That will clean that up, and sorry for the glare. What else are you going to find? I leave you alone, and look what you do. You find it all. I find all the good stuff. I'm just going to leave you alone. Good. I think we've done enough damage. Let's get to the checkout, please. Why? There's more deals to be had. Well, I think we'll find them at the next one, don't you? Okay. Where's the next one? Back in Troy. Okay. Well, I'll be dibbity darn. There's something coming up here. We just got off the highway in Troy, Ohio. And we found another Goodwill. See what good, good bargains we can find in here. Oh my gosh, we just got in the parking lot. Look how busy they are. It is a Sunday afternoon. Oh, they got Girl Scout cookies. 
great. Look what I found. They were just bringing these out of the back room and they had 12 of them, but these clear containers are great for our eBay and to keep track of stuff. And look, they do have like numbers in 2C, so they probably were something to do with the numbering. Oh, and there he is with another cart pushing my cart. He's got a choo-choo train. So $2.99 a container. That's the cheapest we've ever found them at Goodwill. What'd you get me into today? What did I do? What did you do? What'd you ask me first? Any estate sales going on? Yes, I, I did. I ask about an estate sale and we go to an estate sale. It's estate sales by Gwen. Um, I can't remember what Okay, it is. I will look it up. It will be on the screen and we'll definitely let you know. And what's that website that you find the estate sales on? Estatesales.net. Okay. So and it is, they do have uh, an app for it. Okay, let's get going because we got a lot to show you. We spent $67 at this estate sale, which I've already told you previous. Ugh. This is all jewelry, necklaces, pins, bracelets. We put Look them in these boxes. It, this is earrings. Birthday. Where are you gonna be able to buy this at? On our online YouTube auctions on Tuesday evenings. Won't be, in the ne won't be in the next one. It'll be in well, some afterwards. Who knows, who knows when they'll see it? Who knows when they'll see this video? Here's a bag of jewelry. There's another basket of jewelry. This is kind of unique. Yeah, yeah, that's all knotted up. I oh. think it's a belt. Chain. I think someone made this and beaded it. You showed this box? I showed that box. You showed the basket? I showed the basket. There's a lot of jewelry. So what? what is that? That is... Oops, something fell. We had a disaster. It didn't hurt nothing. What brand is it? It's your brand. And it... Electro brand is Electro what it says. brand, sorry. But you can uh, is get it? all over the United States, all over... Uh, you know, European countries is what it's supposed to be able to do. You I mean, can, you can get their radio stations? Yeah. You it looks like a gigantic radio, boom TV, box. You got AM, CB channels. Ooh, I can listen to CB. You got shortwave one, shortwave two, FM, TV one, TV two, whatever air is. WB and PB. Oh, I heard you. That's ham station. I heard you playing with it. And it does And you work. got a cassette player. And it got a cassette player. And we got some cassettes. You can try that I out. I can try that out. Matter of fact, works. if you guys like cassettes, let us know because we could put them in our um, online auction. All right. I bought a book. Hey Wingo, Reading with Phonics, Revised Teacher Edition. What is the date? Copyright 1954 and 1948. So this is a book. Why would I buy a book? Because I looked it up and it's selling for $25 on eBay. So what did you get? I got a Sawyer's Rotomate. Roto Rotomate. Matic. Rotomatic. Yeah. What is a Rotomatic? It uh, does slides. Oh, that you would display yeah. on a screen. Well, yeah, once. Well, but you know what? We have a screen over at the storage yeah, unit. Yeah, we got. He's got to get what else he got. I got a garden broom pro. I'm dumping leaves out. Oh, it's been careful. used. I know it's got a price on it, but what did you pay for that? There's no way we paid that price. Bucks. I paid 10 bucks because she had a $20 price tag on it. Oh. So and I got all the attachments. Is there a manual or anything in there? Well, what's in there? There's all kinds of stuff in there. There's a... They're over here. They can't see you. Show them the bag. There is a manual in there. There's... That goes on the back of it, and it goes into the bag, it goes into the... Okay, now... goes into the chute, it's 20 foot long. When he was looking at this, I have seen, I swear, Commonwealth Picker 
bought one of these. So it's there's, been yep, it's just, we'll see if we can unfold it. So, all That's right, it. one more thing. And we got it. And yeah, I'll wash my table after putting that on it. What brand is that? That is a... Museum, Museum Thomas Series. I yeah, think I looked at the date and I think it's 1997 on the bottom is and what I got this for 10 bucks and they're well, selling again, for 80 bucks. All of this $67. And did I show you the marbles? I, she found the marbles. I don't know if they're worth anything. We have some other marbles from, oh. There's the big one, the shooter. Is that what they call that? Yep. Look at that one. Any more shooters in there? Nope. No. All, only one person can play because there's only one shooter. I'll have to find out some more. So, that is the first part of what we found today. You can go and buy items and resell them for a huge profit by visiting many a different places. All right, we went to a couple Goodwill stores because you know what? You can make a lot of good money going to Goodwill. And what all did we find there? Hey, the force was with us today. It was. I've got Darth Vader. You know, we might have paid $4.99 for him, but he's selling for almost 40 bucks. Now you saw the cart that Jim, I was looking for him with the cart because, oh, I did have something to put in there and I'll have to get that and show it to you. But I really like the Revere wear. And you're like, oh my gosh, look at that bottom. That bottom will come spot, almost spotless. I wanna show you something. Go ahead, keep showing. And you got the two quart, the one quart. This one is proper wear. Oh, that one's proper wear. Yeah. And the so, small fry pan. Four Revere Wear pans with lids. A way to clean this is either with lemon juice and coarse salt will brighten it up, or my favorite always friend is Barkeeper's Friend. And you can buy that like in your cleaning aisle. So I use this a lot. And like I said, the force was with us. We found a Darth Vader. What is a that? A humidifier. A humidifier. I thought it was a mask when I seen it. And mm. we're always looking for Tupperware. And we paid $5 for this. I'll probably sell for like $15 on eBay. And you got this well-told tumbler. I paid two bucks for that. And what did I tell you? It was selling for like 15 on, 15 eBay, on plus, eBay plus shipping. So it goes in a small box. Yeah, might be able to go first class. I'm not sure. You bought all these. I see Chewbacca. Yeah, the Chewbacca Hot Wheel. I bought a whole bag of Hot Wheels. All and, of these. Well, die casts. There's some big ones and some little ones. But almost 70% of them look like they're Hot they're Wheels. Cute. And then there was this hat. Cisco San Diego Hall of Champions, brand new with the tag. And I thought, how can I go wrong? Even if I sell it for ten dollars, you know, yeah, six dollar profit on a three dollar purchase, it might sell for fifteen. You don't know. So I want to get one more thing, and we'll show you that. All right. Oh, by the way, if you guys subscribe, it's free. You know. And it does help us out. Hit the thumbs up. That really helps us out on YouTube. It tells YouTube we're good people. And don't forget to hit the notification bell when you subscribe. That way you get all of our videos. You got to select all. All of the crazy videos. Yeah. So, all right. Well, here's a few more items that we got today. Why we were out sourcing. You just never know what you're going to find. We got a sugar uh, in sugar bowl and creamer. And they are corning. The, they are. I had to peel the tag to see what it was. And this is a Pyrex. You can tell it was pepper. Some left in it. It needs washed and I will wash that. You know, thank God for the 
dishwasher and when you buy stuff. So this will have to probably go in the sink, but Jim has a false craft cookie jar. It says cookies. And let me see that. I don't know if you can see. It does need washed. So that will go through the dishwasher. What? Did, oh, I pulled the tape off. I think this was $5. I'll have to, I'll have to take a look. But this will probably sell for about $25 to $30 on eBay. And this was a dollar each. 99 cents. Those were, it's a dollar 99. Well, it was 99. So, yeah. So we have $3 in that. And you're probably looking at about $18 for the Corningware pitcher. I don't know about the single pepper shaker or salt shaker. Once it's clean, you can use it for either. So again, thank you for watching. We hope that you found this informative and don't forget when we hit 10,000, it's going pink. Yeah. Don't forget your good wills. Like, please. share, subscribe and share, okay. share, share. Don't forget to shop your good wills because they're really getting some good items in. So we'll see you later. Mwah. Later.